Well, good early morning, everyone. It's 12 28 in the morning on March 1st, 2023. We are getting some really good snow right now. It's already snowed maybe three inches just in the past couple hours. Um, the storm's just picking up. We're going to go up to the snowiest part of Big Bear and making fresh tracks all over the place. Haven't been plowed yet, so I'm excited about that. So yeah, we're gonna go up to Upper Moon Ridge real quickly, and then we're probably gonna end up parking at um, right down the street, so I can get out of my driveway in the morning. I just hope I remember to do that. So we're on Moon Ridge Road, guys. We're probably not gonna see any cars out here. Why would we? Hope everyone's having a great, great evening and early morning. If you guys enjoy what I'm doing, please hit the like button. It helps me out a lot. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Um, I enjoy being with you guys. I enjoy doing this for you guys. So thank you. Wow, it's, it's really, uh, this is something awesome. So we've got, as I said, about three new inches of snow down here. Um, and we have a, a, a total of about 18, 19 mm -hmm. more inches supposed to fall in about 17 or 18 hours total. <laughs> but yeah, we're making total fresh tracks. This is awesome. But as I said, we are gonna go up to the snowiest part of Big Bear, Upper Moon Ridge. Let's see here. Oh, I'm just gonna try and get that snow off the uh, windshield wipers. I'm gonna spray the windshield wiper fluid to kind of help melt the snow. Wow, this is, we are making fresh tracks over here, guys. This is awesome. This is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, let's go up into Upper Moon Ridge. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey now, take it easy a little. All right, slow this thing down a little bit. I know that's annoying, that sound, but. So we're turning left on Silvertip. We got the good map back up, you guys. Let me kind of show you guys what it looks like, where we're at. Yeah, I'm sorry, the roads are so bumpy because of all the snow. All the snow that's just been packed underneath the fresh snow. Once again, it's uh, it's 12:30 in the morning, 28 degrees. I think it's, it's it's a little bit colder, but we'll see. Give the car another five to ten minutes to acclimate. And this hill that we just went up seems like nothing, you guys, but I can't tell you how many cars I see get stuck on that hill. It's not good. All right, here we go. Now we're on Lower Villa Grove, and we're gonna turn right here to go up to Butte. Wow, this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Hang on, guys. Okay, turning right on Butte to head up into Upper Moon Ridge. Here we go. So once again, we're going up to the snowiest part of Big Bear. And this hill right here is very scary. Especially since once again, we're making fresh tracks here. And it's very steep. Oh no, it is, it is deep and steep. We're gonna drive, drive in the middle here just to give us some room in case we uh, do have some issues. And then I was also gonna fill up my tank again, even though I'm still at just about under full because of the next storm. I'm gonna stop by one of these gas stations and hoping they, they've got some gas left just so we can be good. Warm knife through butter, you guys. It's a lot steeper than it looks through the camera, I'll tell you that, guys. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna head left here on Myra. 
So this is the upper upper Moon Ridge area. And then we're gonna turn right on Villa Grove right here. So it is 26 degrees now. As I said, my car just needs time to acclimate. You'll start seeing much higher snow berms up here. They, they just they get a lot more snow up here. these tracks going to the right we are going to the left look at this just beautiful our own little ocean Ooh. I can't lie I do get nervous up here I mean, this is incredible. I mean, we are literally the only tracks on this. In the snowiest part of Big Bear. I love it. Guys, I'm tucking in an address here. Because one of our friends wanted us to go by his place. There's no one behind us. Okay. Got the address in because we're going to be going down Sheephorn. He wanted me to show his house. It is nighttime. I might have to do it during the day also, but. I don't want him to think I forgot about him, because I didn't. It's just been difficult. I've been so gnarly busy. Uh, I need to slow it up a little bit here. I mean, you can't really even see. Like, where's where's the road here? It looks like a bunch of waves in the road. Fresh tracks, you guys.
Look at how beautiful the coat, this blanket on the street looks. It's amazing. Once again, guys, if you enjoy what I do, please like and subscribe. Help me out. I really enjoy doing this, and I'd like a lot of people to enjoy these videos also. And the only way that's possible is if you guys hook me up like that so they can spread faster and further. Yeah, we're going through some good snow right now. Now we are leaving Villa Grove and turning on Sunnyside or Sunnydale, Sunny Slope. <laughs> was neither. And now we will be turning right onto La Crescenta. And we're going to take this all the way to Wolf. See the dead ends here as well. So we're going to take this to Wolf. Look at that nice house right there. All right, let's do this. I'm going to put my hand out the window for a moment. Cool the phone off because it's been sitting in the in the uh, defroster for a while. It doesn't take much at 25 degrees, guys, to cool the phone down. And that really cooled the phone down. That's great. All right, freshies, freshies. Big U-turn kind of right here, kind of. Bleep, 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 bleep. Oh my gosh, look at all that snow. It's a sheep horn the way that I know how, which is to the right. And then we're almost to Villa Grove again. We're going to turn back onto Villa Grove. I'm always nervous at this point because I know I still have to go down. And these are the tracks that I made. There must have been another car that, that came up after us, I think. Or no. No, mine are just the, the fresher ones. Right, Luna is coming up here. Alright, we 
right to the left here. And then this gentleman's house is 0.2 miles away. Wow, look at this. Whoa, look at this. Is this even the road? Oh my gosh, you guys. I might get stuck, no joke. Wow, this is scary. I'm not kidding, like my stomach is sinking. Okay, and 0.1 miles on the right-hand side. I mean, these piles are humongous. Okay, 500 feet on the right-hand side. What's this address here for me? This is, this is scary. Wow. We're not gonna be able to really see dude's house. It's at 250 feet and I'm sinking. I think this is it. I can't, but look at it. The snow is more than halfway up that darn garage. I, I'm just, just mesmerized right now. I think that's it. Oh my gosh, now we're coming up to a really scary part. I think this might be his house too. Well, we'll see. Can't see your house, Chip. I think that's it, though, but you can't really see it, man. We'll have to come up during the daytime. But this is freaky. Like, this is freaky, you guys. This is not good. Look at this mansion up here. Yeah, you can't see any houses. Oh, my gosh. This is so deep. Please get down safely. Please get down safely. Oh no, look at this. What am I doing? Okay, this is the scary part. It's a sharp, steep, right hand turn. Put the phone out the window again. Oops. <laughs> we made it to the hardest part <sighs> for real for real but i shouldn't count my chickens before they hatch i need to still focus big time i mean look at this this is how many of you would actually do this i know a lot of responses will probably be like well not many of us because we're not morons i feel like a total moron right now But we got down the steepest part. I did not think we were even gonna make it at one point, honestly, but I didn't wanna say anything. I was just happy that I had a full tank. Look at these beautiful trees, man. Everything is so pretty. I 
icy sign is buried just a little. Gosh, like <laughs> my my body is is like aching because I was so stiff driving down that. It's still bad down here, but my gosh, up there, holy smokes, holy Toledo. I just can't believe we made fresh tracks going up to Moon Ridge and down. It's courage and stupidity mixed together. But I want to give you guys the best footage, stuff that the news media will never show you. A lot of people want to see what it's like in the snowiest part of our town. Okay, we're at Moon Ridge Road. Let's hang a Roscoe. Some more freshies, unbelievable. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> I, once again, I'm not going to lie to you guys. That was one of the scariest times I've, I've experienced it might not have seemed bad but if you knew what I was feeling in the car it, it was not good it was not good it was not great it was very scary there we go cruising down Moon Ridge making fresh tracks the golf course right to the left Take a look out the window. Thank you guys for supporting me through this. I really love doing this. I really love doing it for you guys. So a few years back, I really wanted to start a business up here. Um, and oh man, it was basically, basically gonna be something where for people who were too scared to drive up, even uh, like, but uh, in these types of conditions if the road was open I was gonna try to set up a service where I could come down and drive you up in your car just so you can get to town and enjoy yourself now we're making freshies on this side too but it never materialized I had to get some gnarly insurance for that and I mean, I just, I don't have any money, extra money. But yeah, here we go, making fresh tracks again. This whole drive is just fresh tracks. As I said, we're on Moon Ridge Road again. Roundabouts, you can't tell it's a roundabout <laughs> with any snow there. All right, Moon Ridge Road. 
on this side once again. We're doing the damage ourselves. Alright guys, thanks again for everything. I love you guys. Thank you for all the support. We're not going to do the village. We do it all the time. This is the snowiest part of town by far. So I thought we would stop this now. But come to the live feed. We're doing a live feed all, all night long of watching the snow pick up. Love you guys very much. Like and subscribe. Thank you again. And uh, cheers. Good night to you all. March 1st, 2023 at 1 in the morning at 26 degrees.